word in this specific sentence. Hey, it worked. I think. Yeah, it worked. Nice. All right. Okay. I'll should I turn on the world or like Probably. All right. It's a good idea. Wow. I. Nah, who needs a password? Not like anyone's gonna join this. I've almost filled out the six by six grid at the end. No. I've almost filled out the six by six grid that I made to put all my games on my desktop. Huh. That's. I only have seven left. That's twenty nine. It is. That's a lot of games. Yeah. It's probably good no one's viewing the uh, stream right now. I just spent like a good... Uh, oh, yeah. I love that. Okay. Main engine crash. Fatal mod failure. Which, hey, gotta love it. Which means I have to uh, reload and resize uh, T-Mod Loader, which will take at least five minutes. Yep. Yep. Always gotta love it when that happens. That's spectacular. Indeed. I wonder which mod caused the fatal mod failure. Yeah, that's always the question. Wow, I have done these colors almost pixel perfectly. Ooh, it doesn't need to reload. Well, it doesn't need to be resized. Cool. Oh, well that's good news. Give myself a pretty bad burn this morning. Oh, that's never fun. Cooking rice too. Ooh. What? What? Okay, so every time I load, it tries to tell me to depend to that I'm missing a dependency. So I'm pressing install, and absolutely nothing. There's no new dependency being installed. Oh, that's concerning. It's uh, good stuff. Yeah. I hope, I hope the uh, stream doesn't get copyright struck for having Terraria music in it. That happened once. Oh no. Because so I was uh, talking at the That's... same, apparently the same velocity as a, what was it like, one of those old rappers from the 2000s. So the game thought I was, uh, YouTube's auto moderator thought I was um putting what in, in music. Eventually, there's going to be so much content that an auto mod is just always going to activate. At least one. Yeah. Amazingly, it didn't catch the actual music I put in there. That or it didn't <laughs> care. That or it didn't care. I mean, fair enough, I guess. Everything's working out good right now, I think. Alright, I'm about to fill out another one of those slots. And I just got in. Huh. Wanna know why I'm about to fill out another one of those slots? Sure. That would be right. Ah. It's back. I asked the uh, Horizon development team to produce uh, Horizon for Modded Terraria. <laughs> oh, they might actually do that. Just say 2D Minecraft. Would be kind of funny. I mean, if they're working on a... Uh, what is it? I mean, there's a lot of working Minecraft on... Minecraft Story Mode. Yeah, Minecraft Story, story mode, mode, which is very Just funny to me. <laughs> yes. Oh yeah, we're in Inferno mode. I'm getting bossed around by a green slime. Yeah. Yeah, I forgot to turn it Inferno mode on. That's pretty embarrassing. All right, now that it's been turned on Inferno mode, we're getting we're bossing around green slimes. Oh no. I mean, is that really better or worse? Because that just means we know what we're about to go against is going to be so much more than a green slime. Yeah, but fortunately, we can be well armed for it just by cutting down a tree. Well. Yeah, there's that, I guess. 
What did you say we had to do to the wood? Was it at a furnace? Uh, no, with or... our bare hands. Wait, like we don't need anything else, just wood? I believe so. Maybe a crafting station. Okay, then. How are we scorching this wood? Are we just moving that quickly that we start a fire? I suppose. I think Fair we're... Fair enough, I guess. It's also, uh, class-based, so, uh... Which class are you gonna be? Um... Hmm. Boss Rush. Hmm. Hmm. No I mean, plan, right? Er... Oh. Well... In for hmm. Okay. Uh, no calamity classes. I mean. Okay. All right. I mean, I was probably gonna be mage just because I haven't ever played mage before, and I suppose this counts as a playthrough. I'll try melee. All right. I think love we'll the uh, most objects at your disposal. Yeah, that was kind of the hope. I mean, I might have to be a little more in their face, but then again, we start with basically max HP and, you know. Yeah, let's see, did boss rush mode kick in? Oh, I might need to go out and turn it on, because I, uh, let me just check. Yeah, that's really weird. Oh, no. Oh, no. I might have to go out and turn it on, so let's see. Not download mods, manage mods. Yes, boss horse mode is not enabled. Ha, whoops. Well <laughs> This is a great debut stream. Good thing Indeed. I good All thing I announced it to absolutely places. nobody, so it's uh not as bad as it could be. All the technical issues. They're all here. Yeah, I suppose I could take the uh, Hall of Lever out and introduce myself with a PowerPoint. That was pretty funny, though. Alright, then. Especially when she, uh, uh, edited the PowerPoint mid, uh, mid video. Okay, that's just... That's just... There's the humor. <sighs> Alright, let's see. Oh yeah, my, uh, character is named Bug Person. Mine is called Let's Die Together, so... I mean... Being you melee, you're probably going to be doing. Happening. You're probably going to be doing a bit more dying than others, and uh, being um, what's it called? That's not what's happening. Being called uh, mage, I'm going to uh, die the moment I receive damage. So. Indeed. You know, we we, we have our we have our flaws. You you rush into battle. I uh, have the durability of a wet paper towel. So. Uh, yep. Actually, well, that's by the end of this, hopefully you'll have the durability of a wet notebook. Yeah. <laughs> Improvements. That's something, I suppose. Where did I put that crafting table? How, how have we lost a crafting table? Eh, it's not that big of a deal, I hope. I'm not even in the world yet. How have we lost a crafting table? Oh, there it is. I'm the one that's meant to lose things. Dang, I'm gonna be messed up by these slimes. Yeah, as per usual. I'm not even wearing armor yet. Yet. It's not gonna be good armor, it's gonna be lead, but. It's better than nothing. Yeah, I just got deleted. I think. Oh. Well. Oh yeah, I have to size my uh, screen at, at, at like a certain size, otherwise it uh, doesn't work be with the uh, stream overlay. So I'm playing in like 4-3. Which, you know, okay. it works fine enough, but it's a little bit more cramped than I'm used to. Yeah. Oh yeah, now we're cooking. Just crafted the wall from prosthesis. Well, Wolfram is always good, so I don't see what's going on. Not not always good, but it's good for far longer than people think. Mm -hmm. That's what's needed for maybe. 
Oh yeah, doesn't it have like the ability to suck life out of nearby entities? Uh, maybe. It, just maybe. Love this object. Maybe just a little bit. I actually don't remember if the answer is. Let's yet. see. Yep, I can. I can just fight up steel life force. Yeah. This is going to be very beneficial in the very near future. Yep. Well, I'm probably not going to use it, but I just have that. Well, I have that innate ability to completely forget what I'm doing. That's that. That's why it's called the very near future. It's about as long as we remember. Yeah, good point. On the other hand, that wall from Prosthesis sure doesn't mess around. <laughs> yeah, indeed. And death is a very, very common occurrence while holding it. 23 damage. Not always for the person holding it. Why is my Discord going off when I crack my neck? Can it really hear that? I don't know. Alright, I got you some right, life crystals. I got some life crystals for you. I don't know if it's enough. It's only 84. Um, it's enough. I love this game. Yeah. That's a lot of life crystals. Yep. Now I need to cut. Okay, so now that I have 84 uh, life crystals, uh, nearly complete armor, the mana flower, uh, a full stack of mana potions, and a prosthesis, I need to cut down another tree. That was one tree? Yep. That is maybe just a small amount overpowered. Yeah, I don't believe this is meant for a serious playthrough. On the other no, hand, if it is, I don't I'm not either. complaining, so... Oh. oh, true enough, I guess. Do we go for the diamond staff or the diamonds? Why are there two of them? The diamond staff or the diamond staff? Hmm. I may have just found something better than the wolf from Prosthesis, which I'm aware that might not be, like, something you're allowed to say, but... I mean, there's always the stick. That's true. But, like, in terms of uh, high damage... Uh, early game weapons, the ice school staff might be incredible. Uh, yes. Yes. That is simply correct. Got a lot of inventory cleaning to do. Yeah, that tends to happen. Okay, so for uh, leggings, we only got one option, and that's lead. Really? Hmm. Yeah, there's no, uh, no mage, um, Leggings. Interesting. Yeah, it is an odd choice to make. We could get your meteor stuff, although that would take forever. Eh, well, there's, I, there's, I'll probably be able to get meteor stuff after beating the eye or something. <laughs> yep, normal progression. Nothing out of the ordinary at all. That is actually fairly regular progression. I have Cthulhu to meteor stuff. Some people, the truly insane, don't even go that far. What do you mean? Gotta get, gotta get the um. It takes beating the brain to get uh, meteor. Just blowing up one of them, unless they change that, which I can see calamity doing. They do hate fun, but indeed they do hate fun. Alright, so for accessories, uh, tell me if you think this is a good early mage setup. I got the, um, the cloud in a balloon, the mana flower. Um, Very good. The lucky horseshoe. Yeah. The, uh... Yes. You can. Should I get the, should I go do the Amida spark or the, um, Robo drive? Ah... Uh... I don't remember all of what the rover drive does. I think it just better? it gives you a uh, shield that absorbs 40 damage and grants 10 defense. Oh yeah, that's probably better. As opposed to because releasing a blast of sparks when you take damage. Yeah, you're a mage. Taking damage is already deadly. 
That's true. Um, and then I got one other slot, which I think I'm either going to put the Anklet to the Wind or the Tiger Climbing Gear in. Hmm. Wait, I... no, the Banner Regeneration. That's oh. a way easier idea. Oh, yeah, easily. We really need to tinker quickly. Yeah, he'll... not to worry. The second thing we fight is the uh, Goblin Invasion. What the hell? So I'm going to start building an arena for that. This is actually very normal progression, but it does not feel that way in the slightest. Yeah, it's because of how fast we're doing it. Yeah. So Calamity Mod Inferno mode takes forever to load, apparently. Where has it stopped? Uh, put a finger up next to it, and if it, uh, if it speeches past it, then it's loading still. You see, my trick for that is having the screen so small I can see the individual pixels. That works too. I forgot to get the Alchemist NPC mod. Whoops. Hmm. Uh, Inferno mode isn't loading. tried turning it off and back on, I'm pretty worthless with the uh, realm of mod crashes. Uh, usually mine don't stop mm -hmm. moving, they just uh, self-destruct. Wait, are we even using Inferno mode? Yeah. In what ways? The added challenge. Like, I thought it was all of but okay. You could probably turn it off if, if we need to. Yeah, it's not loading. I'm not sure why. Wait, is it's it's Infernum that's having a problem and not uh, Light and Shadow? No. Oh. Or, wait, yes. I would have guessed Light and Shadow would cause way more issues because it has all the. Uh, Particle effect adds ray, adds ray tracing to Terraria in a single mod. Well, you can see the reason that won't have issues is because my computer won't calculate it. It just straight up won't work. Which is really rather funny. I mean, it's not like actual ray tracing, it just puts some light behind trees. Oh, well. Then. That's pretty simple. I mean, this computer can run pretty graphically intense games. So and apparently, yet. apparently Infernum isn't one of them. Nope. It's so weird. Terraria multiplayer needs to be a lot easier. How do you craft Insta houses again? Wait, I have a recipe browser. It's wood, table, chair, torches. Oh, it's just 50 wood and a torch. Oh, well... At a workbench. You know. Or I can make a hundred of them from, from Goblin Wares, so I'll just, wait till, I'll just wait for that. Yeah, that's quite a few. Let's make all of them. I mean, there aren't even that many NPCs, so... There's quite a few, but there's not that many. Should I uh, turn the world off and back on again? Um, if you're loading mods or something, yeah, you can. I haven't loaded any meaningful things yet. Alright. Should I fill the last six slots with? I have two extra slots under vehicle simulation, and I have four under battle royales. 
with vehicle simulation or... or battle royales. What? You should fill it with a vehicle oh. uh, simulation or battle royale. Well, I'll let you see. Um, that would be an issue. Actually, Don't have any you know of those. What? I can do it this way, because arguably Rocket League is vehicle simulation. It's pretty simulated. Actually, no, that's flight simulators. I'm incorrect. Just factually incorrect. Um, well, I can do Well, with Rocket this. League, it is a simulator and you do fly sometimes. Well, that's not... I'm not wrong, but I'm not right. <sighs> That's not what I meant, but okay. So now I have one under vehicle games, and I have one under flight simulators. I can fill the flight sim easily. And then I have still four under battle royales. Arguably Risk is a battle royale. I suppose in the uh, so most technical sense. It's the first battle royale, in fact. The game of war. Indeed. Do you think Warhammer 40,000 is a battle royale? Not yet. Mm -hmm. It's a board game. That's true. I mean, I guess so is Risk, but this is digital Risk. I wonder if they haven't made a uh, 40k video game. That's like, just the actual game. Oh yeah. Oh. oh wait, I know why. It's because they want to spend. They want to spend money on plastic. On plastic. <laughs> Yay! Environmental damage. I mean, it's not like that plastic would be going to anything else. It's like uh, tires. That's not. Wait, yeah, they're not... actually. Yeah, I'm right. They would. They aren't even made the same plastic. No. I mean, they aren't running lead anymore. Hard. Tires aren't exactly plastic. Oh yeah, they're made of lead. Oh, he I heard. Okay, sure. Tires Wait, no, did I say, did I say and... tires are made of lead? Yes. Oh no, I meant rubber. Yes. That would be correct. Alright, so now I have one extra under miscellaneous. Hmm. What's a miscellaneous game? Just uh, name any game you would put under a category of miscellaneous. Robocraft Royale, because it's not a game. <laughs> I, I think it, it has to be a game. It hasn't had uh, upload times. It hasn't, it hasn't had a time of being like online since, uh, what was it, like 2018? Yeah, that's kind of fair. Um, ooh, what if I put Visual Studio under it? I suppose Does that that's count? A <laughs> Well, I mean, if you take it to the uh, most extreme way you can, it is technically a game. It's on a screen, and you're stimulated watching it, so. Uh, arguably. <laughs> then again, in that case, right. I guess that means going to the grocery store is a, uh, that's a game. That's a sport. Extreme sport. Indeed, especially on certain days of the year. That's true. Such as Black Friday, or, or the day other before days Easter. before Christmas. Oh yes, or the day before Thanksgiving. Or That's Valentine's true. Day. Oh yeah, uh, location jump scare turns out we're American. <laughs> yep. That doesn't match with the uh, implied isopod game anymore. What is implied? I don't know. I'm funny at times, Ooh. so it's definitely uh, inaccurate. <laughs> Okay, fair enough. I was saying isopod gaming is lore. Okay, now we need to make you some lore. <laughs> nah. Also, I'm sorry I haven't made the VTuber yet. I've oh, been it's trying fine. to actually get good at making... I've been trying to get good at cross... I mean, it, it's fine. Words. It's, uh, I'm it, no rush, like, seriously. I've been trying to train a program more easily process artwork. 
The issue is that programmer really hates me and doesn't like making it. Uh, so I've had to do it myself for a lot of the time, which looks fine. Uh, the issue with that being... I would spend ridiculous amounts of time making it look good, and then the it, and the issue with that is it's on multiple layers, so it's going to start acting like multiple things. So... Uh, has, I, has Inferno mode loaded for you yet? What I um, no. I'll close the world and reopen it. Alright. That's hardly, probably not the issue, but in case it is. Alright. I have one flight simulator left. I can fill that. I have one vehicle game left. I could put Robocraft 2 on here. They made a second one? <laughs> yes. Is it any good? It hasn't released yet. Ah, uh, I mean the first one's dead in the water, so they're doing the yep. uh, o they're taking the Overwatch route. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. But you I'm see, really uh, sad that it's the Overwatch route. Overwatch. Is, Although uh, I do have Overwatch on here. That's a vehicle simulator. No. No. About to see, we both know what I meant by that. No, it's not. I'm not accepting criticism. Actually, there what did I mean by that? <laughs> the hamster is not a vehicle, thank you for asking. He does have a vehicle. He is not a vehicle, thank you for asking. I suppose that makes sense. Oh no. I do have a hunting game on here now. I think... That's new. I don't know if it's anyone's done like... it yet, but I think it would be kind of funny to have like... Some game that has a hunting side mode, but it's just like the most hyper detailed, unnecessarily uh, complex type of hunting you've ever seen for the rest of the game. Mm hmm. Like, you don't just kill the deer and get some venison, you have to skin the deer and take it apart naturally. Go through all the work. And you have to legally hunt the deer, like with the right calipers and weapons. But then, when you're, but then it's just like some survival game, you just have to. The yeah, hunting is uh, strictly enforced. <laughs> Yes, it's apocalyptic, but we still have laws to abide by. Come on, guys. Even in the grim darkness of the far future, the IRS still exists. And no, that's the DNR. That's true. Although the IRS totally would still exist. They literally have a plan if the world ends. Are you freaking kidding me? I'm not. Oh, the world's ending, but... What is their plan? Road tax is still to be paid. So what the heck is their plan? I don't know. I just know they have one. Oh. Okay, that's just extraordinarily weird knowledge to have, but okay. Yeah. Wait, I, I think I, I think there's a, a um, multiplayer patch I have to install to make Inferno work. Oh. Well. Uh, that could be the issue. Easy fix. Alright. I also have the results of someone saying, let's do Gmod, but with more realism. I Gmod kid you not, that is the idea behind this game. It's Operation Harsh Doorstep. Ah. It's, it's literally Gmod, but without certain features, and they've made it more realistic. Realism? I don't... In my Gmod? Exactly. It's more likely than you'd think. Uh, I still don't know why this was created. It's just Gmod with guns. Isn't or, that regular Gmod? Or at least well, can't it be? Yes. Yes. Alright, let's see. So, uh. Oh, cool. Fatal Mod error. So, I guess Gmod World War II Edition. That is not a sentence I wanted to ever have to say. Isn't that just Half Life 2? It's quite a jump to make, isn't it? You anger me. Okay. Mission successful. That's not... What? Ever tried to freaking paint first... a shark on the side of a guy? What? Just paint a shark if on I... an action figure. 
uh, no. This uh, is the most I, Warhammer thing. Well, I've I, heard I can I can week. tell that's because you. Uh, I can tell that's why you have it because you're still alive. Are you trying to? Medical uh, assistance. Not just one. Um, twenty-five. Oh, okay. So then you'll be alive. Got it. Oh, yeah, you'll be dead. Yeah, one is manageable. Twenty-five might kill me. Yes. I suppose it really could be worse. Says could man. It? Says man in a situation where it's very difficult for it to be worse. <laughs> could see, it? How about my mods turned off? Uh, I sure hope so. Oh no, it's back. I don't know. Ah yes, Inferno mode multiplayer is, is off. Ah. Huh. If it crashes again, that I'm gonna be, be mildly trip. ticked off. Just mildly though. Like we don't condone too much violence. Just yeah, I mean, I, can't, I can't get that angry. It's just a single mod. Alright, we're under the constructing like, just phase. Just a moderate amount of violence that we permit here. Enough violence okay. to make want to play Ark Survival Evolved. I mean... I'm not sure how Ark players does, handle it. It's... Like, the world's that worst That does technically uh, fit into one of the game categories that I haven't pulled out. Yes. If you would like, we can go to that instead. Nah, I don't know how to play it. Oh, Neither cool. Neither do I. Inferno multiplayer patch does hate me. Good. So, uh, that's crazy. As per normal. Hope this movie don't have to start up another world because Infernum has world generation now. What? Yeah, it adds an arena for a few bosses. The arena looks incredible, but it's, uh. Okay, good to know. I wonder what the mutants called in Spanish. Because I think someone made a Spanish translation of the mod. Oh. Huh. Yeah, I can't speak Spanish, but, uh. One second, let me get a translator. Hmm. Let's see here. It's, it's mutant with an E. El Mutante? Yes. That's awesome. Alright, I think I'm gonna turn off Inferno and start another world. Alright. It would be, uh... Would be Why does my browser think that I live in Oslo? Isn't that in Poland? Uh, I'm not sure. I know that's Warsaw I'm thinking of. Yeah, that's the capital. Uh, Oslo is the capital of Norway. It's near Poland. Uh, I think. I mean, it's in Europe. Same same continent, but that's kind of that. I guess Europe is one of the smaller continents, so it's not quite as egregious as saying like. You know, Egypt and South Africa are in the same continent. That must be pretty close. Um, well... Yeah, I guess that's accurate. Let's see, how far do I have to scroll out from Norway to get to... Okay, oh. I, I was gonna change the world name, but I think Zany Sticks of Starvation is pretty funny. What? <laughs> You've named it what? The Zany Sticks of Starvation, that's just the auto-generated name. Okay, they made their auto-generation far better. Wait a second, if I was trying to do a uh, lore-based debut like uh, almost every other YouTuber does, why didn't I play Subnautica? <laughs> and find yourself. Oh like, yeah, that's right, I hate Subnautica. One of the textures of a character with yourself. Well, Subnautica's fine, it's the, it's the loneliness that I don't like. Because then I have to edit a video. Then do multiplayer. Oh yeah, I forgot to do that now. Indeed. Just don't do Below Zero. It doesn't have multiplayer. Below well, Zero just isn't that good. I mean, they tried something different. The issue is the thing that was different was most of the game. Yeah. 
Guys, there's only one small difference, and it's the entirety of the gameplay. <laughs> yes, the small difference is, um, well... Alright, I think the world trailer will be joined soon. The way you play the game, and the location of the game. You're yeah. literally on the opposite side of the world. And the fact that it's a voluntary exile and not a real one. Um, well, semi-voluntary. I suppose I haven't looked at Below Zero since it was, like, not developed yet, so. You just gave up on it back then? Yeah. Fair enough. Alright. I think you should be able to join now. Connecting to cream of cheese. Connecting. 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 Is it connected? It's connecting. Nice. That's about all I know. Oh! Terraria now says also try don't start. I like- I, I'm personally rid of those as the uh, Terraria now with sound. Ah, uh, yes. I mean, I do miss soundless Terraria, but I'll, I'll admit the sound design is pretty good, so I'll, I can let it slide. Wait, we played when Terraria didn't have sound? No, Terraria's always had sound, it's a joke. Okay, good to know. If some NPCs died, don't worry, they'll be back in the morning. I suppose that is helpful to know if you're a first-timer. Yes, it also sounds a little bit more than a little bit dark. I mean, that, that guide fellow is kind of helpful. <laughs> At the start, when you don't know what you're doing, yeah. I mean, the change is always actually and... helpful throughout the whole game. Oh, that's good. Uh, slight issue. We've played this game for literally 300 hours. That's rookie talk. I, I've been playing the game for uh, way longer than that. It says I got uh, 2,000 hours on Team Unloader. Break. Oh. Hey. Then. Uh, yeah, that's more than I have. I think I may look at running for... overnight a few times, but... Not yeah, too many times. just a couple of times. Look at my time, Space Engineers. Not near as many as you have in this game, but it's also not as popular a game in general, so... Alright, so, uh, great news. Just cut down a few trees, and I also found you a sword shrine while going out to the left, so... I have no use for it, yeah. so it's yours. Alright. Wait, why, why, so... why do I hear jungle music? Ah, uh, because you hear jungle music. Power on. Wait, you can hear that? Uh, a little bit. I can hear well, that. Well, you're gonna really hear that. Wait a second, what is this? This isn't a sword shrine. This is like a bunny shrine. You can hear whenever I take damage. I sure can. What's an amethyst crawler doing down there? Other than, uh, perishing. Ha. Huh? Spawning and dying. It's a terrible circle of life that these creatures have grown into. Oh, never mind. He did. He, he got his last uh, act of revenge on me. Which was his uh, thing fell into the uh, water, and I wasn't able to get to it. Yep, no amethyst for you or amethyst, depending on what is that? If you're British, I don't believe anyone says it that way. <laughs> Hello. That's a good thing. Uh, do I remember what button I set my inventory to? I'm gonna hey, work I need button. to die real fast. Alright, here. Oh no. I'm, wait, I can't. <laughs> because I can't open my inventory, remember? Just let me die to the slug. Alright. Here comes one. I'm, I'm just gonna go this way. And cut down more wood as I can. Because once I die, I can reset my inventory button and everything will be fine. Oh, wait, was it F1? No. 
I think you've well, you, something. some pretty weird tech issues. Yes. Except the thing is that this is a result of the tech issue from last time. Alright. Shoot. Your uh, Terraria character Wait, somewhat resembles a uh, one of those contestants on like Naked and Afraid. <laughs> this was random, mostly. That's impressive. Partially. Well, not to worry, we can handle the afraid part, so. Oh, well, you know. Wait, what? Oh. Oh, I'm done. Alright. Alright, tech issue solved. Nice. I don't need this. Hey, one or two pass death? No, you probably already have one, don't you? Diamond. Why am melee? You're gonna wanna craft the, uh. What's it called? The wooden sword or something like that? No, wooden hammer. Wooden mallet. You'll see it, it's made from like 10 wood. Yeah. Then you just make some refined lumber and you got the, uh. Absolutely nothing can stop you. I've made 169 refined lumber. You only need like 8. I'm aware. It is enough. I mean, likely is. Actually, what swords can you make? What? I've, I haven't played this with uh, melee. Oh, uh, right now I'm not even looking at that yet. I'm just creating, uh, different equipables. Hey, you might want a life jelly. Yeah, I'm... that might be a good idea. Thing is, I only have uh, so much stuff, so much like inventory space. I guess that's fair. Tiger climbing gear, frog legs. France. Once night falls, I can set up the uh, blood moon because that's our first encounter. Alright. We have to get. Oh! Uh, I didn't realize we could make Cosmo light. Yeah, I'm just waiting because uh, we gotta make an arena too. Yeah, of course. I have an unholy amount of life crystals. I you'll need like 15. Made more because I didn't realize you threw me them. I know. They're a material for something though. Heart lanterns, which and we gain access to things. later. And a couple of other things. Such as the panic necklace. Wait, you can craft the panic necklace now? Apparently. At a tinker's workshop, of course. But, you know. I love deviant art. Alright, it's beginning to look a bit nightish out. So I'd, uh, gear up. Okay. I think you could access to, like, platinum armor or something like that. I see iron and lead. Oh. So you don't get any special melee armor? Uh, not that I see. Ouch. You're right now. Oh, what the heck are you? What the heck are you? I'm very stone. Oh. Oh! These are all very good things that I'm seeing right here. Oh, no, I am seeing some pretty cool things here. I'm seeing some armor. Alright, cool. 
Because I can understand Mage not having armor, because Mage usually gets the short end of the stick in early game, but... I guess I shouldn't say that when summoners yeah. have to go into the early... have to go into the jungle, but... Yeah... This is a yo-yo? Oh! Oh no! Everything is going to be dying very soon. The child's toy? Well, to a lot of things. Uh, one of them being bootleg vampire knives. Let's see him. Uh, Ooh, do they heal you? Let me see, is this them? Yes, this is them. Nice. Yes. Alright. If I didn't put Maris the browser right there. I'm still setting up my things. Which is... Wait, I can just craft Wolfram Scrap Metal? You can. Okay, fair enough. It's under, I think, Summoner. I huh. crafted all of them just to look at what's there and if any of them would be useful generally. I suppose. I have like 94 forest points and I don't know what I'd use them for. Uh, everything. All at once. Bunch of maggots. Indeed. Actually, no, it's also possible via range. I think I'm gonna get rid of the encumbering stone, it's really not helpful for me. No. Not very. Potions. Actually, yeah, what potions can you make? I don't think Oop. I can make any, but I have a lot of them. That's the sound of nighttime. Yeah, that's not concerning at all. Okay, more cool. Wood. There. Jesse, we need to fight. I'm Look sorry. at how many mobs I'm... there are. Yes. Rangers this get away. Is very good. Rangers get away easy because they have they can um they get to make grenades. Wait, are you freaking kidding me? All right, so I'm gonna be dying a lot. Uh, I should probably set up my inventory, but then again, that's for. Uh, they might have sparked. might have sparked would be huge right now. Actually, that's that's a good idea. Yeah, but I am in fact using it. It is extremely good. And my entire, the entire main row of my inventory, or I'm sorry, not main row, pop bar, is filled with weapons. This is a lot of loot. We're gonna, so we're gonna get so much money from this. I dropped 14 gold. Once we're, once we're done being disassembled, we're gonna get so much money from this. It is now physically impossible to kill me. I'm using the vampire mouse. I don't even regenerate that much from this. And this is what. Um, what did I just get? How much blood parsley do you have? Um, I picked up three a while ago. I haven't been able to look up her once. Alright, because that's, that's our next uh, refined lumber. Oh! Oh yes. Oh yes. I'm now using the soul harvesting thing that deals like 70 damage. No, it's the bat hat. I'm sorry, I'm wrong. It, it deals 74 on crit, but I have such a high crit rate that that doesn't really matter. I mean, that's pretty healthy. Unless you're the mobs. Yeah, not really healthy for them. Imagine doing this with eternity mode. Well, we would be dead, but then again, so would they. I'm probably grinding for the uh, Soul of Eternity way easier. 
Yeah. Well, Katana time. I really wish this had more knock. Well, look I at that damage, though. Complaint. I have forest points rising to the top of the screen. Oh yeah, look at all those forest points. Rising to the top of the screen. I've got a 375 forest points and rising. I'm not sure where they're counted. Uh, wanna, wanna be done with this? This is pretty ridiculous. Um, no, we can go for a bit. Yeah. This gives us new items. Blood That's oh, true. I just picked up 50. I got a uh, hundred five on me right now. I don't know where I even picked up the fifty nine, uh, but I'm pretty sure I have well over two from doing this. Yeah, I think we're. Uh, I think. I think we're good. Yeah. Next. Next stop is cleaning up all the damage. Oh, I only have one hundred sixty five. Oh. Oh, wait, which item was it that I picked up that drops stuff from the sky? All right, that! Alright, first, first thing we had to do was take apart the, um... All of the gravestones. I almost just threw away my only pickaxe. That would have been very bad. Yeah, that would have been not... So that would have been subpar. Alright, our, our next foe was the, uh, goblins. Who are marginally That's easier a to deal with. Ah <laughs> oh, yes, easier. They are. I have so many shackles. Uh, I'm just gonna start equipping random of these in uh, random slots. Such as the frog leg. Wooden bow, I can get rid of you. I'm done looking at these because they're not very helpful. Okay, which one do you think That's looks better? The, the wedding veil or the top hat? I haven't looked at your character in ages. Um, top hat. All right. Objectively. Yeah. I only have one piece of armor, and I committed an entire slaughter. Uh, that is impressive. I wasn't done crafting yet, but here we are, I guess. So. I have so many shackles. That. Yes. Alright, 106 blood parsley. What can we do with that once we're done cleaning this up? I'm gonna start removing weapons that aren't as good. Just this, this. This doesn't heal me near enough. Extremely slow speed. Average speed. Alright, so with the blood parsley, we can make platinum armor, finally. Alright, that's also going in the lower slot. This is just actually getting equipped. Alright, I think the uh, blood parsley is mostly used for making um, potions. Because like, if you go over here, you'll see how many potions there are to make. Okay. On the other hand, I do get access to making the frost bolt. Good. Which will be um, definitely not unhelpful, even if it's probably not going to get a very large place in my uh, usage. Same with the Vile Thorn. Oh, more blood parsley. For the most part, the parsley oh, is dedicated to being um, for potions. That's fine by me. Let's see, what don't I need? I now have a mount. Nice, which one? What in the heck is that? Fat meter. Oh. Oh, right. Uh, I have... Nope. This mount. That activates when I click the recipe browser button. Tundra leash. Heart reach potion. Inferno potion. Iron skin. 
Reduces life force. damage taken by 5% or 5% increase. Hmm. Oh, there's platinum. Swiftness, Thorns, Titan, and let's see what other ones are there. Wrath, and Pumpkin Pie. All of that for a, about 20 blood parsley. That's pretty good. It okay. is certainly not a bad deal. I was honestly only half listening, but that seems pretty good. Yep. Oh, and I get to make honey fins, which are better healing potions. Um, well then, I can just get a giant shield, or a giant shell, sorry. No one around me needed to live. There is no need for that. Alright, let's see. We can put the uh, bloody tear away, because we don't really need it anymore. In case we need to get more parsley, so I put it in a chest. We also have to make the goblin battle standard, which is required for progression as our next foe. But the first thing we need to do before that is build an arena. Uh, we don't need arenas where we're from. Oh, Zach, I found the good stuff. What? And by good stuff, I mean we're all gonna die very, very quickly. Um, uh, battle potions. Oh, yeah, I, I neglected to use battle potions. It would make the, uh, some of the swarm attacks a bit faster, though. Now that I'm really floaty, I think I'm back to uh, operating on my preferred environment. Which is likely deep space, just because of, like, I mean, I jump super high and fall super slowly. Gravitation which... potion. Would you like some? Nah. Hunter potion. Hmm. I'm going to be so stacked with potions. Iron skin potions. Remember, you don't need all of them, just most of them. I need I need a whole load of them. I got a mining potion, why did I do that? Ah, uh, because why not? Very simple. Good point. Why are all of these potions very good? This is ridiculous. Well, they are technically all accessible by this point in the game. I mean, yeah. It is a little it's insane to give us insane. ten minutes into the game. Wait, infernal potions are in no way accessible at this point in the game. What are they? What are they cooking? Uh, they are cooking things that I like. That's true. We let them cook for a reason. Indeed. This is a terrifying amount of items that I'm holding. No, I need to stop unequipping that. The rotted fork. Uh, oh, right. Depth crusher. The depth this is a hammer. Really impressive. This counts as a hammer. Nice. Oh yeah, uh, I'm Clem, putting it in my hammer. Chainsaw recently. Nice. The rally. How are? How do you stack up? Actually, fairly well. I'll take it. Enchanted sword. That's huge. Actually, wait. Are you able to get the teragram? Yes. 
All right, because that's a that one's a game changer for the goblin invasion. Oh, oh, yeah, that uh, new um, yeah, I forgot that all these were enchanted, which changes the entire game. Forty-four defense. Oh, and I didn't even get my new uh, what's it called? Didn't even get new uh, armor. Pressure, you're only 47, and you're fairly slow, but you are impressive, so you are up. Does there. a lot of damage, and it inflicts a debuff on them. Yes. Alright. Well. I gotta do the uh, platinum pants real quick. So, when I press the buffs button, um, a lot of stuff happens. Should I get the amphibian boots or the rocket boots? Uh, I ha- I grabbed the Dun Dune Rider boots, but I would recommend the Amphibian ones. Alright. Uh, do you think it's time to fight the Goblins yet? Ah, uh, you know, we can absolutely steamroll them, you know that, right? Good point. Alright, uh, so, let's see, you have the Aterogram, so I think it would be smarter for you to stay down there. I'll stay up here and bombard them with the, uh, Icicle Staff and Frostbolt. Yep, that's fair. All right, and if if need be, I can always hop down with the vile thorn. All right. Actually, I can get rid of those two. Are they coming or no? They'll be here in a minute. Oh right, sorry, I didn't see the message because I was looking in my inventory and not outside of my inventory. My inventory is almost entirely. You can just my put them in the uh, piggy bank. Almost entirely... Wait, how? Do... Wait, can we craft that now? Oh, I got. Can I just naturally got it from drop? the uh, drops, but maybe. Oh. Okay. Oh, uh, goblin. Oh, they're here. Indeed. I'm thinking katana. Alright, I need to adjust that. Then. Maybe that, 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 that. It is yo yo time. Oh, yeah, we're also immune to the goblin sorcerers, except for their contact damage. Yep. Plasma rod? What does that one do? I remember it being magic. It fires the laser beam, if I remember right. Yeah, and it's way more helpful when it hits the floor, not the enemies. That's not that good compared Wait. to, like, the Vile Thorn. <laughs> you know it's bad when the Wolfram runs from you. We're steamrolling these guys. How many goblin wares do you have? Uh, I don't know if I have any. Oh, 58. I've got 12. We might need might need to fight more than one goblin army. Maybe. Wait, what? I can't. Pick these. Oh, there we go. Can it hit me? Oh, it can. The sorcerer can hit me. It's just it usually doesn't, because of the Inferno Potion. Yeah. It's unlikely, not impossible. If I'm moving away from it. Oh, right. I forgot, I have a Gravity Potion on it. Imagine it gives you some pretty impressive verticals. Also some pretty trippy ones. I've just incinerated multiple enemies. Also, the the attacker takes damage when I attack. I'd imagine it's good the attacker takes damage when you attack. When they attack. Oh. I can kill these soldiers without even hitting them because now they're all. Uh, all right. So, what's your uh, what does your wear count look like? Um, hundred and five. Thirty-seven. 
Yeah, we're probably already fine. Yeah, I'll. I'll oh, you can make your uh, piggy bank. I'll just uh, ask Wait, you about. Yeah. yeah, it's what's the goblin wears. Oh, perfect. I'll just ask you if I need any more because I uh, probably will run out at some point. Okay, well, uh, my inventory isn't, or my crafting is entirely filled. Yeah, I gotta go put some room. blood celery away. Some freaking what? Blood parsley, that's what it's called. Oh, right. You said celery, though. Yeah, I was off by, off by, off route. I got a harpoon and I accidentally used it. Runs over. Uh, let's see. Yep. I can make 99 insta houses. What? I'm doing that. Need the NPCs. Um. Should I go for the jungle armor or the wizard hat? Uh -huh. I'm doing hmm. the jungle armor. It's a much better deal. And I get the set bonus. Which is. Yeah, I guess so. Be better mana usage. That's not that helpful. The uh, Magna Cannon, new weapon, what does it do? That's it. Okay, that's a huge amount of damage, but... Yeah, I was gonna say... It's not quite showy, which is a little sad, because that's kind of what I was hoping for. At least I don't need the mana rows anymore. Oh, I can make the cell phone? Oh, Wait, we can? Didn't need to grind at all. Yeah, they really weren't kidding when they said no grind, huh? Uh, yellow right. horseshoe balloon. Gonna make that. Freeze up an, it frees up an accessory slot, too. Why do I still have this? The magnet cannon's way better. Although it is a bit harder to aim. Uh, let's Trinket see. Trinket of cheese. Oh yeah, here you can make, you can have that if you want. Oh, you can craft. No, it. I have one. Yeah. Ninety-nine insta houses. World token. Cycles Mini difficulty. Insta bridge. Insta bridge. Luxor's okay. gift. What does that one do for me again? I remember it's like absolutely cracked for uh. Luxor's oh, yeah. gift is every weapon emits a projectile. Oh yeah, I just want to figure out what my projectile was, because you got the uh, bouncy balls, I just have a second projectile. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I suppose that's not hor that's not horrible. It's just not that helpful. Yeah. Alright, favorite this one. Um, the Abyssal Amulet. Do I want that or the Shark Tooth Necklace? Ah, uh, Abyssal Amulet or Shark Tooth? Yeah. I don't think Shark Tooth is really doing too much for you. That's true. Uh. Plus, we are going up against a worm boss next. Yes. The Desert Scourge. Not encountered for progression. Well, not required, but I'm doing it anyway. Wait, what? I'm off to go fight the Desert Scourge. I have the Vile Thorn and a. Uh, and the Abyssal Amulet, I should be able to win in like 10 seconds. Fair enough. I was looking at something, I'll say. Oh, that's uh, good. Old Lord Claymore. Um, what the I think I remember heck? using that one, it's like, cracked. Alright, I'll give it a try. Feels like I should I be able to- do something to the healing. I think I should be able to like, dash right now, but I know I don't have- I know I don't have any dash. Alright, well that replaces my range is range ish weapon. Alright, so I see you've made the desert scourge occur. Or exist. I don't think I needed to build an arena for this guy. Did I say arena? Hmm. Yeah, that wasn't hard. Yeah, he does kind of die easily. Putting that over the mana flower. I get a, I get a balloon animal. And some dye. That's 
Cool. Which isn't really that noticeable. And oh. a and a pet. Wanna go wanna go cheese that guy to go get a bunch more pets? Do I? Yes. Am I going to immediately? Not quite. Alright, uh, but I am instead going to get Terra Spark. I'll go fight him again. Do that are they made from Unity to on fire? Unity to fire logs? Alright, yeah. Boy, when you over prepare, Desert Scourge really isn't that hard. Well, yeah. Oh, all those drops are down there. I mean, I mostly popped him to get the uh, pickaxe. Oh, uh, looks enough. like I don't get. Looks like I can't cheese him for uh, summonables. Oh, that's a shame. Summons a flamingo mount. Oh yes. Oh yeah, I think it's actually pretty fast. All right, 219 pearl shards. What can we make with this? Something. I'm sure. I should probably also get the other two summons we need from this before I put, before I put it away. Those being the Eye of Cthulhu and uh, King Slime. All right. And then if I need Goblin Wars, we'll just go back. Plus 20 max life. Didn't I have something that removes max life? Ham axe. First of many, no doubt. And a pickaxe. And a ton of Tesla potions. Summons an R of electricity that electrifies and slows enemies. Yes, please. That sounds fun. Now I have uh, two uh, uh, effects around me at all times. I look even worse. Huh. Yep. I'll make the coral spout. Aquamarine staff. What does that do? Okay, that's not that. That's not that good. It does replace the uh, prestises, though. What? what the heck am I looking at over here? Also, this thing is just death to all crowds. What is this? That's a relic. Okay. For a death good scourge. To know. Okay. Check this one out. Yep, I've seen that before. I don't remember where, but I've seen that before. I think I'm gonna he use absolutely it. absolutely demolished his crowds. Or worms. I'm gonna go fight a worm again. Whichever one. <laughs> That's fair. I mean, I gotta test it, and he's, he's right there. I'll be there in a second. Actually, with all the buffs yeah. I have, I can probably just run into me and win. You can run into him and he will die. Yes, that is accurate. Though I wish we could craft wormhole potions easier. I guess that's true. I wish the cell phone included that. Yeah. That was easy. He's dead. Yes. Syndragon. Dead. I made a spark. <laughs> Good stuff. <laughs> also, I have 99 pearl shards. Oh yeah, those those will help you out. They can build build the stuff like the uh, Tesla potions. Nice. Do I need Luxor's gift? I mean, I do like more airtime. Wait, what does Luxor's gift do? Uh, fires oh, the uh that's projectile. Weapons. Yeah, that's weapons. I changed it out for the arrow stone though because I want even better jump time. That's fair. Because I'm getting stupidly greedy. This weapon doesn't have a projectile, which is annoying. This weapon doesn't have a projectile, and this weapon doesn't have a projectile. However, the one weapon I'm carrying that does have a projectile absolutely murders crowds. So, I'll take it. Oh yeah, that's a pretty good one. This is like the best projectile. Alright, I believe that I am ready for whatever else happens to occur. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna finish building this. 
but this is I'm, I'm outpacing my own build speed, so this isn't much better. Oh. Up next is uh, King Slime. All right. I think I'm killing Wolfram just by touching them. We could make Visitide gear. Uh... Look at how huge he is. Yes. Oh, there's my fourth points. I have 556. Let's fight him another couple hundred times. All right. Just to be. Want sure. a uh, you know here also. Want Plantero? What? El Plantero. Uh. Wait, we can summon Plantero? No, but I can get the uh. I gave you a pet. Oh. A small Plantero. Oh, that's cute. All right. Was there not an armor with this? I don't believe that there was a new armor since Platinum for me. I don't think so either. However, I did just get a bunch of crystallized gel, so let's see what that does for me. Ninja armor. Oh yeah, that'll do it. Uh, pearl shards I can use to make Visitide armor. Would yep, I can- Visitide armor? armor isn't too helpful for me, so I'm going to uh, forego it. That's probably fair. I like the aquatic heart, though. Alright, this side gear, I choose you. I'm gonna put some uh, boss summons away. Do you want the uh, ninja armor? Oh uh, no, I have better gear than it. Alright. Yeah, we're just gonna put this away. Of defense, so it doesn't really matter that much anyway. Ooh, treasure bag, Desert Scourge. Nice. I opened it and walked right away, didn't I? Yep. Alright, well... Oh, wait a second, we gotta place down some insta houses before we do anything else. Yes. Up next is the Eye of Cthulhu. Alright, I think we should um, build our. Uh... We're going to shred it instantly. Yes, but we should uh, we should at least treat it with a little bit more respect than uh, we've given the other two bosses. All right. I so, guess. I'm gonna finish the uh, arena we have and build some insta houses. Fair enough. We're gonna kill it, but it, it at least deserves to uh, know why. But it. Yeah, we're gonna kill it, but at least it's not as brutal a death as it could be. Yeah. Where is the... this. This will part. Alright, so now I have um, everything good. I need to get a better pickaxe and axe. Oh, that, you can get you can get that from Visitide. Wait, I can't. Yes, uh, Pearl Shards can make you the uh, Great Bay Ham Axe. Oh, great... Great bait pickaxe. And the uh ha and the reef claw ham axe. Oh. Okay, fair enough. So how high, how high should our um uh what's it called? Uh Kowloon Wall City get. Um all the way. Uh actually no, we should probably avoid wyverns. So as I could have reached a point where that's a where that's a genuine concern. Well, it will be eventually. Good point. Oh, I didn't oh, I just messed that one up pretty there. bad. Fortunately, I have enough missed houses that messing up doesn't really matter. Well, yeah. I have so much visual noise on my screen. Yes. I think we all do at this point. That's true, but I've got a smaller screen than I usually do, so I'm truly not used to this. Oh, yeah, that's that's going to be rough. Alright, let's see. I think... Okay, so this place is done. 
got ourselves a uh okay we have that's more um that's more than i thought we w we were ready for but we still got 12 houses so as long as we leave them alone we should be able to uh why does everything want to kill me well you are melee so it probably uh you probably have a slightly that's higher reason. like being noticed ability it's probably a fair enough reason. And it's yeah. nighttime. I'm just gonna stand here and do this because I was doing something else, so. Okay, that that was a bit mean of us, wasn't it? I just stood there and took it. For the first time ever, Melee actually can take it. Yes. Of course, I'm gonna dig down and get to that stuff, but. Well, you know. Not that bad. No. Alright, so I have one item that I equip instead of another item when we're dealing with a swarm. Um... I don't know when that next. when that'll next happen, so it might not be of too much importance for us right now. I believe that's pirates, but I'm just gonna leave it equipped in vanity. Actually, what weapon, what weapon is that that um, like sprays the red sights everywhere? Uh, that would be the legendary blade crystal sword. That's way faster than I remember it being. That would be because it's legendary. Ah, and probably because they have a ton of. They probably aren't being uh, negatively affected by our armor set bonuses. No. Wait, what's this? The Gladius. Huh, alright. Fair enough. Tesla Potion! Alright, do you want the uh, shaking present this time? It gives us a pet. Let's see what's in it. Tiny Ice Queen. Uh, hmm. Looks like this. I don't really care. I like the dogs more. Blue Fairy. What are blue fairies? Here, run a skull. Wait, what does... Uh, always. <laughs> of course I will. Yeah, I mean, it's like, what are you supposed what to say when... What does a skull? Is that even a question? Yeah. What else would I say when offered a literal skull? Good point. <laughs> Let's see. All I gotta right. clean up my uh, inventory. Like my act is looking pretty ugly right now. Oh, don't worry. We all do. Uh, let's see. Don't need the shield of the ocean. I don't think I need the coral spout or the diamond staff anymore. Now let's see what I can make with the. Uh... Oh, we don't have boss spawns are stackable, do we? Ooh. All right. I think I picked up all of the Eye of Cthulhu uh, special drops. My bad. So here, I got some for you. Wait, what? I picked, I picked up some. Some teeth? Oh, no, I didn't pick up any of those, but I can just kill him again. That's true. Uh, for me, he gives the Grey Zappinator, the uh, Sky Glaze, the Harvest Staff, and the Acid Gun. And the, I, well think the, I think the Acid Gun is better than the Magna Cannon. The harvest staff. I you gotta replace the I gotta replace the uh, aquamarine staff, so I'll get rid of that. The sky glaze. What does that do? That gets rid of the icicle staff. The gray zappinator. Well, it's not that fast, but get some magic conch. And our next boss yeah, is, is the Eye of Cth is the Eater of Worlds and the Krabby Line. Here, let me do something quickly. All uh, right. This won't take too long, hopefully. I mean, how bad could it be? Touch me, I dare you. That's what I thought. Well, if you wanted to touch you, you should probably get close to him. I need more of my weapons to deal wrong. 
I need more of my weapons to be ranged-ish damage. I can just actually take it. Like, this is bloody hilarious. There's the ouch. Yeah, alright, needed one more of those. Sorry for, uh, interrupting. Ah, that's good. How do you make the, uh, instivator? Ah, uh, you simply do. Let me check. What's the magic conch for? Oh, it takes you to the, uh, ocean. Oh, right. So, 99 mini insta bridges from a goblin wares is pretty good. The insta vader, on the other hand, has to be put together manually. Big cringe. So, I think let's do some actual digging to get down there. Because the next bosses are underground. Oh, I didn't. Oh. Alright. More monsters, cheeks. Great. With this. No. I won't take it. Summon damage, but no. Add Cthulhu Relic, because we're just filling up this whole place. Demonite. Uh, I should care. I don't. I ran into something and it immediately died. I haven't even explored that much. Let me amend for that crime. Yeah, I haven't gone too far to the left. Yeah, let me do that. Should I've got 572 like force points. Nice. Oh, now I'm getting desert points. I only have 12, but now I'm getting desert points. Demolitionist. Demolitionist. What we need is a goblin tinker. I think we have to find him. Left is a jungle. I know we have to find him, but you know. Although they are kind of giving that to us. Yeah. Like we already have late hard mode, or late pre hard mode uh, boots and stuff. Yeah. And other similar things. I don't see any rare enemies nearby, so I'll let you know if I find them. Okay, well, I found the corruption, so, uh, one sec. Hold. Hold, please. That in my inventory, that in my inventory, and that in my inventory. Are you winning? Yes. By how much is another question. So he's not a complete walk? Uh... For me, right now. Although, it is impossible to kill me. So... Yeah, I'm sure, sure he'd be winning if we weren't incredibly tanky. He'd be winning if I didn't regenerate whenever I killed a single part of him. I can just stand under this thing of water and I'll kill him until he dies. Which is me not functioning as I say words. That's what that is. He's a bit laggy, so he's going through me just a little bit. Um, but, you know. I just found a, uh, My skeleton weapon also goes through. That's good. Yeah, let's see what he's selling. Uh, this doesn't appear to be that helpful. We got the uh, Strange Brew, the Glow Stick, a Counterweight, and a Calcium Potion. A Calcium Potion. I'd like this image to be immune to uh, fall damage. 
All right then. Shaking presents. I only got 17. I think it's because most of my kills were done through walls. So uh, let me amend that by doing it on the surface this time. All right. Um, make sure to save some drops for me. I'm going to the underworld right now. All right. And I've already killed a quarter of his elf. I deal so much damage that his damage does not effectively matter. I heard of, I, I can sometimes hear your character getting injured. I want to turn down the volume a little. Bit. Oh, I'm not complaining. It's just a little funny. I'm aware, but it's maybe a little too funny. Um, uh, regenerate please? I'm actually fairly low. That's not good. Oh hey, you'll never guess what I just found. Um, the underworld? Well, what, you'll never guess what I found inside the underworld. Uh, demon fork? Here, you'll, you'll, be, you'll be aware in a few seconds. I'm gonna, I plan on dying, so I probably shouldn't. I'm gonna die, I'm not gonna do that. Is it a demon fork? Uh, no, it was the, uh, uh, Gad Voodoo doll. Oh, great. Please don't. I was gonna, but I realized I'd die immediately, which was the plan. But I had 71 And I'm away. literally in combat. Please do not. Good point, you'd be dragged away from it. And I'd be killed. I dropped an entire platinum. That's what I get for doing two boss fights back to back. Hey, it's coming towards me now, so it's not that big of a deal. It doesn't he get enraged. Also, when we die, it takes like 20 seconds to respawn. So don't, don't die. Alright, I'm back. Uh, how many did I get? 17. Oh, but those are actual presents. Those aren't something else. There's the- oh, okay, that makes sense. Oh, that's really interesting. So does he have, like, a specific drop? Uh, I believe so. Might be wrong, though. He has, from what I can tell, only presence. Well? Oh! I can't tell where the rest of him went. I think, I think we're gonna have to get killed by him. Well, it's somewhere. Unless his one head or accounts for a quarter of him. Well, I've got a piece of moon squid, so I'm happy. That's the pet one. From the moon lord. Yeah. Here, uh, I'll put these in the chest because they're different than other things. This, it, um, if I wasn't being killed right now, that would be really convenient. What are you getting killed by? Everything. Ah. Are these vanity items? Yes. So, va so the order in the chest is pets, vanity items. Wait, is this my chest or is this? Oh, wait. I've just been putting stuff in chests. Okay, it's in the right. It's in a chest. And the last item is dies. So if you want. A lot of dies. Such as say Dragon Soul die, which is what I have equipped. That's a pretty good one. Late game. Yes. He doesn't appear to drop anything else. Besides, of course, his bag. Oh, is he required for a progression? He 
he is recovering from aggression, so he must be doing something wrong. Hmm. Alright. He's also, uh, not spawning very often. Like, I'm fighting two or three heads at a time. That's a little bit odd. Just make the fight annoying, though. Menacing worms, bro. Oh, demonite orb. Alright, well, now I have that established. Okay, what? Oh. Frickin' weird. Uh. Right, oh, so now that's he's what back. we get for worm food. Where's Hold. he at? Uh, well, I found the whole thing. I believe. The whole thing being defined by what? The uh, entire worm. Oh. Well, he, came, right, he came back in. Good to know. What's a demon conch? Where's the writhing remains? Do they spawn somewhere in the world or something? Oh, I found out what the, uh, object we need to get was. What was it? Uh, shadow scales. Okay. Which is fair, because that's normal progression. Yes. So I'm gonna go fight him again to get a few more, because I only have 82, which is way more than I need. And... let's see. Ooh, I can make meteorite armor. Oh, we can craft, uh, Molten Armor. Oh, nice. From demons, from Shadow Scales. <laughs> well, you can't have it by now. Flare Bolt, let's go, that's way better than the Frost Bolt. Oh. Okay, well, that's an upgrade. Uh, let's see, Dogtooth, oh, Stealth Strikes. Um... That is a very, very serious upgrade. Like, for the point where I'm not sure my other stuff is going to be effective, right? Anymore. One, two, three... Okay, we need to get, uh, two more auto-houses up. Ignores 100% of enemy defense. Alright, well, that's a new boss. Uh, fight item. Nice. So, what's... Reduces what, damage taken by what does this one do? Too uh, bad, I already have that. I'm gonna twice. launch this out. Tell me what it does. Um... That's pretty good. It's a demon staff. We all know what this one does. Have we fought the brain yet? No. However, I don't believe we can summon him, so... Oh, right. Ooh, the Eternia Crystal. Oh, this encounter is not required. This encounter is not required for progression. All right. Weak are. Old ones, are we? How have you done this? I set. I just set one up. Oh. All right. Well, I'm going to um, endlessly slaughter them. Yeah, this isn't very difficult. I'll hold this side. You hold the other side. Yep. Ah! Wave complete. Only uh, 30 seconds before the next one. I can no. handle your side too. Um, okay, I'll go do the next boss then? Nah, I, I was mostly just joking. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to handle both sides with the sparkling Empress, but... I mean, I think we could reason. I think you could reasonably kill both sides. Yeah. It's just range, that's the question. Why do I have. What these up is this? I have lost the power of creation. Alright, fair enough. Oh wow, the Sparkling Empress isn't actually that good. Wait, what? 
It's pretty low damage for its incredible abilities. I, I do not believe that. But okay. So I have two boss fighting items, and then I have to uh, remove the entire crap out of items. Like, this is a t-shirt cannon. Yep. Who's next? Who do we have to fight next? Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, the hive. Yes. If you want, I can go do that quickly. Oh, wait, I think I figured out a workaround. I'm gonna be a, a large fan of this idea. Gotta get some yeah. goblin wares out. And Here, I'm gonna let you deal with the. I don't mean to necessarily abandon you, but that is kind of what I'm doing. Uh, we just got the automation. I don't know what he does, but he sounds cool. Yeah, we haven't done anything to reduce this entire game yet. I just know we'll need a few of them. Yeah. Alright, my idea is the, uh. the, uh, Queen Bee. Yeah, but, we fight but Queen also Bee. I can. We fight How Queen about Bee we do here. both? How about you do Queen Bee and I'll do the Hive? Well, we can do the Hive at our home. Oh, that's right, we can't do it right Wait, now because I, uh. Some of the old ones army like a buffoon. It's night now. Yes. And rage is outside the underground. Uh, so I'm gonna do it in the underground crop. Fighting Reddit. <laughs> Ah, uh, yes. Let's eliminate the entire hive line. All at once. This weapon. Wait, is the, is the hive line I ignore these. Uh, not exactly. But Never mind, Sparkling Empress is pretty good. It's not, it's not incredible, but it's still pretty decent. Alright, that's good. Uh, the Hive Mind is really annoying. They I'm usually are. Killing it, but it's also really annoying. Alright, this is the final battle. Once I defeat this man, I should probably leave, because I do have to get somewhere by 7, and it's about 20 minutes away. Alright. Uh, well, in that case, I'd say this has been a uh, successful, uh... Yeah. Been a successful this fight. This has been a successful literally, like, two hours yeah. of actual bus playing. Well, it's been about, uh, one hour of us playing. <laughs> An hour of, uh, tech demo. Oh, yeah, right. Yeah. Now that we've played uh, tech issues in the game. Did we just lose? Ah, dang it. Ah. Well, uh, thanks for watching, everyone. And I'll see you next time.